Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome back to Ostrov. And patch six just arrived. So, where were we last time? I see we're in August of 1727, so we've got the harvest coming in. We've got our two farms up and running, and never enough workers to do the job, that's for sure. We're three weeks into, into the harvest season, and we've only done a little bit over here. Over here... Field one must be this one. We've started that one. We've got just the one worker there. Let's fire off, say, four over here and four over here. I still have never fully established whether or not they like the permanent jobs more so than the the temporary ones. If the game will wait, you know, toward one or the other first. But uh, let's go ahead and get both options available. It's uh, there's spots for six people per farm we established last time at least farms of this size of of, of the site 15 size so we've got the potential of you know lots of workers of lots of jobs available for these workers but we need to provide more workers because there's never enough so 20 thatch sitting there we don't need you anymore 15 fish in there we don't need you anymore let's work through the rest of this. We've got to shut down the uh, construction jobs too. Um, we got here. Carpentry, nobody called up. We did get our plow though for the farm. Good. Uh, let's just continue on through. 660 nails. We'll go ahead and shut you down for a while, bring you back later. We'll let's see. Warehouse. Don't suppose we really need somebody in there at the moment. And same with this. Let's get the harvest in. Then we'll, we'll work on uh, getting everything up and running again. If there's 200 firewood and there's 200 wood in there. So, yeah, we're fine there. We'll leave the uh, uh, the granary going and all the market stalls going. But Taylor's Workshop, I don't think we've got any textile in. Nobody hired over here for the, the weaver's shop. So we'll, re we'll restart that one later. Over here, you were bringing in hemp, sunflower, oil, and just sunflower and textile. And stored... Hemp. We're going to be harvesting hemp, but we're going to—it's going to be a while before we can actually get it available. Is there any sitting in here? No, nothing sitting there. Family out of money, and nothing sitting there. So you don't need to be employed at the moment. And who is out of money? Right over here. We we're having trouble with that one before. Just not enough jobs in this area to keep them going. Yeah. Um, let me finish my tour here, then we'll talk about patch six update. So we got to there. You were the shoemaker's shop. There is still leather going. We need money, so let's keep the shoes being made. Drop them off in the stalls. People will buy them, and that'll bring money into the treasury. You were a warehouse that was bringing in firewood, which may not be necessary anymore because one of the improvements with this update was that the market stalls could now start bringing in firewood. That would be nice. So I don't know if an existing market stall will. Maybe only new construction. So we'll get to that in a moment. Over here, we still have no hay, and we're desperate for it. That's right. Um, what I didn't realize in the last round of, of episodes that I put out was that this has been added to the hay dryer too. So we can hire people to, we can up the wages to get people in here. It's going to compete with our um, our harvest, but I really need a round of hay sitting on these racks before it's too late. We still have a black bar, which means we still are within a season that's capable of doing it. So let's take these guys up even to 150. Let's go as high as that. So we're going to get hired uh, laborers, men or women, 150% of wages. Let's get these three racks and these three racks over here full of hay before the season's out which I don't know what month that is for grass it's not going to be the same I wouldn't imagine as the harvest we have the harvest we have until the end of November but I'd have to guess the grass would go away by then all right so those six are done let's continue through no more jobs over there the tannery um, reserved leather, stored leather, there are no more cows marked for slaughter, uh, so we definitely do not need the slaughterhouse anymore. The tannery, the slaughterhouse has nothing in reserve, so unless there is, or hides, we don't need this person anymore either. Okay, so it is just now a matter of the shoemaker bringing all the leather over and making shoes. So, otherwise, trader, 
we don't have a use for right now. So we'll shut that one down. Uh, dried fish is stored. So we bought some dried fish. Okay, so let's get some dried fish out into the market stalls too. But over here, uh, nobody working and one person working. 1.2 flour stored. Flour, we have nine in the system. Let's shut you down too. Let's just make sure that we eventually fill this up. Now, I'm going slow and it's only been you know, three or four days since we started. They tend to take about a week after leaving a job before starting their next one. So I'm hoping we, as we roll into early September, we're going to see these jobs start to start to file in. And there we go. They're, they're starting to find new jobs. Good. So we get the harvest in. And they do want to do the, the worker slots before the labor slots. Even though labor, oh, it's not paying more. Let's take you down to 120 and you down to 120. Keep it even. What we got over here? Um, we've got 100 and 120, and let's do men and women for both of these right now. And we'll go ahead and do the 120 as well. Pretty important that this happens. This turns into uh, all of our product uh, productivity with all the stuff that we're that we're going to be uh, harvesting here, as well as you know, food. Food's important. Um, over here, you were meant to bring the wheat over, and you did so. We can turn you off for a little while. These guys are off. Is that the end of the jobs? Cow sheds we're not going to touch. There's one person in each. Um, I'm thinking that's it. We hit all of these. You. Um, sunflower workshop. We have a little bit of sunflower stored, and that's it. And what was in the, in the warehouse over here? <clears throat> we had hemp available, but nobody wanted the job. Yeah, that's right here, Weaver. Uh, there's a little bit of hemp store. We just got to get it transferred across but right now. We'll just work on the The harvest, but let's go ahead and kick it up to speed two. We'll kind of I'll well, get right here. You guys can see the fields Look at that They did jump into the labor slots instead of the worker slots Interesting over here. It's the opposite Okay, well, I'm gonna forget trying to predict patterns here. It's not going to do me any good. <laughs> Two opposite results there. Um, patch 6. Added an option to turn off water reflections. So if you've been having trouble with the uh, uh, with the graphics of the game and, and it overwhelming uh, your system, giving you low frame rate. Right now I've got a frame rate of 16 and 18 sitting in this position. It might be different with different parts of the map. There's 19. but So it's running a little slow for me. So that might even show up in the videos. Videos run at 30 frames per second. So this is coming a little slower than what I what I set my uh, YouTube videos for, my recorder for. But it still looks fine for me right now. But you can shut down water reflections, which will... I don't know if I could do that in-game, though. Let's try. Options, normals, water reflections. Where would that be? Water reflections, normal, no reflections. Okay and back and continue so no more reflections i'm still running at 19 and 20 now so doesn't oh, there's 22 21 it's slowly creeping up okay yeah it's holding pretty steady 22 you guys can't see it i've got a little red number right there in the corner from that fraps does for me so i can see my my frames per second but yeah, I'll leave it off for this episode and try to remember to turn it back on next time. Um, you can now sell firewood through the market stall. So let's pop into probably our secondary one that was selling the the uh, what I call the luxury goods. Because this is just your basics, flour, potato, milk, and fish. Anything in here? I'll tell you what, let's turn off milk. Because we hardly ever see it anyway. And let's go ahead and put firewood in that slot. Awaiting firewood. Look at that. Okay. Well, that is working fine. Yeah, we'll go ahead and do that. We'll, we'll let milk store up for a while, and then we'll put them back in somewhere else. So in place of milk, let's put in firewood. And then we'll see if there's nobody working here. Is this the one that... No, it was the right here where we couldn't get anybody working last time. There's someone there now. Dried fish is in there. Oops, leave that. And we have some available. Okay. Um, so this one needs some incentive, I guess, to, uh, to get to work. Interesting. We'll pop it up by one notch and see if that helps. Because uh, there should be a lot of people available for work now. They're kind of moving in and out of the farm, I guess. Um, where else? Right there. 
milk to firewood. And then over here, this one. No, we never put in the basics over here because we were having trouble finding enough labor. So there's three places that can be bringing in firewood, which means we don't really need this one anymore. In fact, we don't need it at all. Although I was thinking this would be helpful for bringing in leather. Let's do that. Leather and go ahead and hire that again. And if the leather right now, or she right there, and we'll follow her right well, if I can I click her? There she is. She's bringing the leather back and forth. And then she'll make shoes. If she only had to walk from there to there, it would happen even quicker. It hasn't been too much of an issue. Ah, there we go. Let's pause a second. You are going to bring a whole cart of leather in, aren't you? So over here, leather, there's still uh, you know, only point 0.1, though. Interesting. Where'd you go? Reserved. Point one. She's coming to get another point one. Nope, right there. Zoom in here a little bit. Why did he only get one, a point one? Maybe that wasn't him. Oh, there is nobody there. Never mind. I, I thought that cart pulled out of here, but it didn't. So she's just been doing the point ones back and forth. But if a cart could roll out of here, get a, a 1.0, and drop it all off, and then she just went back and forth right there, we'd have a much faster uh, production of shoes to dump into the into the shoe market. Right over there. Beef. Hmm, nobody working there. And either one. There or there. Nobody wants to work there. Interesting. Got quite a few houses in the area, too. Over here, we do have someone working there. No shoes at this one, though. Next shoes would be right here. So shoes, and she's not going to get any at the moment. Do we have any to get? We have 2.2 shoes in there. Messenger from Marifa, and that takes me to the next thing that was added uh, showing separate notifications from when messengers arrive basically we have a messenger from it's gonna pop up over here now and if we get multiples then we'll get multiples over here so I'll pop out of that we've now got a a messenger message which is nice so if you don't happen to notice that little symbol right there you aren't doomed so you guys want to buy sunflower and sunflower oil and you want to sell us hemp, wheat, and live chickens. I'm going to pass, but I would like to buy some more cows. I'm thinking that would be smart and turning them immediately into beef and shoes. I'm thinking that's where we're going to get uh, our, our treasury back. So we need to hear from this one, Balaklia. It's always fun to say that one. Um, yeah, I'm not going to do anything with these guys, so we'll pass there. So, Blacklea, we, we, we need you, and I'm not going to spend the money to go and ask for you to, to come. Now, and when we do that, we've got to figure out just how to do that. Um, we've got seven in here. We've got nine in there. So, probably want to make sure that we've got less than ten, and then we'll order ten. Last game, last town, I ordered more than it could handle, and that cow shed crash after that never worked again. So I finally just had to abandon it. Then we tore it down to get you know our citizens trapped in the con in the deconstruction process, and they were permanent statues. So I'm learning little pitfalls not to fall into again. We are getting close to done over here. We are although we're into October, we're going to be done in time. Be nice to pull back on some of those wages if I could. Let's go to 110 and see if people are willing to continue uh, uh, being hired. Minus and minus. So, did that affect anything here? No, we got more people in. <laughs> ah, go figure. <laughs> All right, did we ever get anybody working in these two? Uh, that is a, that's what I want. No on you. And there's another one in there. There we go. So, no and no. Nobody working in those. And last episode, I believe it was, or maybe the one before, we had the granary come in and start stripping these market stalls down and I only realized afterward it's because nobody was working there anymore it was this one they were just taking all the stuff away and something else I noticed last time the chicken coop when I last time I recorded five or six episodes all at once and so I kind of sat back and edited most of them all at once and I got to that's the first sound I've heard the whole game um 
I got to uh, sit back and watch them all together rather than spaced out over days and days. I noticed something. As soon as we set the chicken coop to 10 out of 10 eggs for breeding, I never got another egg out of it. All the eggs went away. I went down to 5 again and even take you down to like 25. So we'll start uh, um, immediately you know, lopping the heads off of 5 chickens and making more chicken meat. And let's see, chicken meat was also something else that came up in the, in the update, but we should start seeing eggs come in again. Otherwise, in the system, do we show eggs? Chicken meat? I'm not seeing chicken eggs or... Okay, let me look for eggs. No, I don't see chicken eggs or eggs in there. Okay, and still no eggs here. So let's pop into the egg stall. We have... Chicken eggs, chicken egg one. Let's pop into the granary and chicken eggs are checked. We've got, are you seeing them there? I'm not, I'm seeing chicken meat <clears throat> that's it. And there were eggs dropped off all the way out over here, right? Yeah, eggs and I've got five eggs over here. Reserved 20 eggs, whoa, what, huh? One egg over there, so and two eggs. So there's the first eggs we've had for a few episodes because we've been sitting at 10 of 10 for a while. So we got new eggs starting to come in. Where's those 20 eggs at? Reserved. No. Where are you getting those 20 eggs from? Awaiting. One egg. All right, maybe I read that wrong. I don't know. Over here, we've got one egg. Okay, so they're starting to to uh, process eggs again. So maxed out eggs, it just turned off. So there's, there's something wrong there. I'm not sure what. Oh, we're still doing this. I meant to turn those off right at the very beginning. Okay, then, but we're still getting the harvest in. Yep, we're doing a pretty good job. Okay, well, that's good. In that case, we got ourselves a town hall, finally. And Mayor, hmm, Arcady? I think it looks like Arcady. Okay, Mayor Arcady, who lives where? Here? Yeah, you live right there. There's Arcady. And you've got a household income of only two. Wow. Normally the mayor is the richest person in town, in our towns. Something went terribly wrong there. Marcus Stall and Town Hall, they've, that's how they were employed before. Why? Hmm. Got 18 chicken eggs over here really like their chicken eggs I tell you so there was a comment many episodes ago right when one of the first episodes of the uh, of, of patch 5 that um, said that there was a problem with the eggs they're buying them but not using them I'm curious to see if that 18.4 ever drops there goes 18.3 that suggests to me they're using them whether that was just fixed right now or not, I don't know, with patch 6. But um, I didn't see the evidence of that comment. I looked around and I didn't see a massive stockpile of eggs all piling up and never being used. Yeah, we're down at 18, 17, 9. Yeah, we're using them. So what else happened in patch 6? Crop rotation settings will no longer be removed if you fire the manager. I had not noticed that before. I've not been firing managers. Now we're bringing all the crops in. Let's shut down the jobs here and just use laborers for that same thing over here um we'll do we'll leave two in place though just to make sure in case no other laborers show up bring this stuff in that stuff's going to go here we need to get this guy hired again uh right there because they're going to be hauling in the hemp which is all over here so it's available for all four of these ladies right Let's get the weaver shop up and running for good this time. Hopefully it happens. And wages, we'll go ahead and take that to 110%. But that didn't do us any good over here yet, did it? Still no worker there. Or... Boy, it's hard to get into that one. Marcus stall there. No one wants to work here for some reason. Anything I'm not aware of? Don't have a blocked path or anything like that. Interesting. So we got the... Houses. Well, we got yeah these two houses in. Still working on these. This one is not critical. Let's swing you to the front and turn you on. But yeah, we're gonna get it done anyway. We're not really gonna use it. We're gonna mothball it or or we'll mothball this guy. Maybe we'll do that. 
let this stuff just sit there. We'll turn this one on for a while and get some, some logs and firewood kind of stored up down at this part of town. And that's one way to get uh, to get uh, firewood close to everybody. Stick a forestry close to everybody. That was the forestry right there. Okay, let's go ahead and put two workers back into there. Make sure everyone's got, uh, got jobs coming out of the harvest here. Um, over here, you are on... You... We're already here collecting firewood. We don't need any more of that, so we'll turn you off. Turn uh, all three fishermen on right now. Don't need any more thatch. Uh, get the nails going. Uh, warehouse going too. And you can stay off. What else? Don't need the carpentry. Don't need any more carts at the moment. Did it hire? Oh, we got two weavers in. Good. Uh, sunflower will be part of this. And was there were there any here? None there. Over here. Yes. Okay. So let's get you turned back on again. One person into the oil workshop. Um, let's. Hmm. Well, when we do buy cattle, we will then mark several for slaughter and make lots of room. And well, I think we can. I think we, this will go fast enough to not worry about overwhelming the uh, the thing. So we'll worry about turning on the slaughter and, and tannering those jobs later. But uh, shoe makers workshop. We've got nothing left over here. There are no goods left. Yeah. So that is done for now. Let's get a flower up and running again. Uh, we get you up and going. Oh, we've got, did I get the firewood into this one? I did. So you no longer need to do firewood. We can turn that off and just continue doing wheat right there so what are the jobs have i missed to get back on again let's go ahead and keep a person in here six sunflower oil that's that's going to be viable again potatoes are going to be viable too um what do we got here potatoes 26 and it doesn't give the sense there's anything left in the field no we've all picked up okay and we have plenty of time to bring the rest of this stuff in all right we're yeah we're good there over here Two workers still, and still two, a good two and a half fields worth left. All right, we'll leave the two workers there. And there's two over here to finish this off. Okay. All right, more jobs. We Are we good? Ooh, we have a little bit of hay. That was empty. Ooh, good. This did happen. And are we... Oh, we're still potentially in the season. Over here, this happened too. So we just needed to give them a little incentive to get out here. Okay. Um, it'd be nice to give them, boy, a little more incentive. Can that still be done? I got a 200%. Money's holding at 280. It's been that way this whole episode. Let's go to 200 on these. And doesn't say anybody's working. It'll be a picture of a face right there if they are. Let's do the 200 on all of these through the rest of the season. This last, well, two weeks. Let's see if we can get just one more person in here to... You know, add a little more hay for the winter. Seems too much to have to give that much to bribe them to come to work. But I'm going to make the guess that hay production is not, uh, you know, top on the uh, on the list of priorities for the game. Well, we did get, she was probably the uh, the worker for the, uh, the cow shed. They will come and do the job too. But... They weren't doing it last time. We sat there and watched them. They just, they just sat there and you know played cards. They never came out to, to really do any any work here. You are you are over here at the, uh, the the sawmill, the forestry. So you're bringing in hay. You are you're bringing in little tiny pieces of hay, aren't you? Yeah. As the cows cows shouldn't be. Oh, cattle are in. Cow. Where am I? Here. Field. I think it, yeah, that'd be synonymous with pasture and right there. So the cattle are in right now. So you are just bringing in right there 0.07. Just little tiny pieces to keep topping off the the cattle. Yeah, okay. So you're going to just constantly be topping off and never actually get out here to work on this. So I could throw another worker in, but we're at the end of November. We're basically walking into winter time right now. And weavers, still two of. Okay. Um, I think we're about there. It's going to be a little short episode right now. I'll go 
do the last little notes of the patch and do another episode or two and then we'll wait for patch seven not a lot of changes we've already seen the majority of the, the big changes otherwise some things that were that were fixed slightly reduced chicken farm productivity um Sometimes there was a construction priority crash. I guess move the priority and things would crash. We had that happen early on, uh, episode seven or eight or nine, somewhere in there. And I finally created a new town because there were problems like that going on. So that must be from back then. I have not seen it since then. Uh, let's see, canceling pause construction didn't work properly and caused crashes once in a while. Um, livestock limit on chicken coops didn't save. I think I've seen that too set it for something and then go back and it's all different so no eggs in stock right now eggs in here we've got 12 eggs in here say we're making eggs again we weren't making them before um what else some citizens were so undecided that they switched jobs before they even made it 10 steps to get to the first job so all kinds of little fixes like that he's he's noticing he's he's kind of going through and cleaning up touching up there'll be you know these early updates are going to be kind of foundation work toward larger updates later you gotta work on your optimizations you gotta fix little things here and there to make sure things are working then you start bringing in new content and then you figure out how the new content broke everything you've just fixed and you go through and fix it all again oh the joys of making a game with that i think i'm gonna call this one done it's been noble rambler thanks guys for watching and i'll catch you i'll catch you soon Bye bye